What really happens during a female orgasm, it's one of the most complex and fascinating responses in human biology, far more than just a moment of pleasure. We'll break down what's happening inside the body, the brain, and the reproductive system when a woman reaches climax. Every orgasm begins with arousal. Blood flow increases to the pelvic region, especially to the clitoris, labia, and vaginal walls. This causes swelling and sensitivity in those tissues, a process called vasocongestion. The vagina also begins to lubricate naturally, and the uterus elevates slightly in what's known as tenting. Externally, heart rate rises, breathing becomes deeper, and muscle tension begins to build. These changes are part of the body's preparation for orgasm. When orgasm occurs, it's a full body response. Muscles in the pelvic floor, uterus, and vagina begin to contract rhythmically, usually about every 0.8 seconds. This series of contractions may last anywhere from a few seconds to half a minute. But the brain is just as involved. The limbic system, which governs emotion and reward, becomes highly active. Simultaneously, the prefrontal cortex, responsible for rational thinking, goes offline. This helps explain why orgasms can feel like a loss of control or intense release. At the chemical level, there's a surge of dopamine, the pleasure neurotransmitter, and oxytocin, which promotes bonding and emotional closeness. Endorphins also flood the system, providing natural pain relief and relaxation. After orgasm, the body enters the resolution phase. Blood flow slowly returns to baseline, the vaginal muscles relax, and the uterus lowers back to its resting position. Breathing and heart rate normalize. Unlike most men, many women don't have a refractory period, which means they can experience multiple orgasms with continued stimulation. However, physical sensitivity often increases right after orgasm, so comfort and consent remain key. The female orgasm is a powerful and multi-dimensional event, combining physical release, neurological fireworks, and emotional connection. It's not just about reproduction or pleasure. It's a vital part of human health and intimacy. Understanding it helps break stigma, encourage communication, and promote body awareness. Because pleasure, when rooted in knowledge and respect, is a form of empowerment.